get sued. I'm being sued by an employee. What? I cannot believe it. Today is finally the day that we have the business update in BitLife. I literally was in the bathtub when it came out. <laughs> so it took me a while to be able to get ready to sit down and actually start filming and to see what it actually entails, but I've made it and we're gonna do that today. Make sure you guys go watch my tattoo vlog of me getting my first tattoo. I'll have it linked down below. So make sure you go watch that. I wanna give today's post notification shout out to James. Your comment was really sweet. And remember, if you guys wanna shout out one of my videos all you have to do is subscribe click the notification bell and comment down down below with that being said let's get into this business update okay so i haven't actually read through this yet but i did update the game welcome to the business update oh my god so here is the full list of things that are new and it is a long list why am i nervous start up your dream business in 25 different industries Build your company from a feisty startup into an empire. Okay, so we can do startup. Get enough cash, acquire an existing business. So I guess that means we can buy businesses. Add, manage, and retire different product lines. Calibrate production to meet ever-changing demand and competition. Deal with the consequences of excess inventory. <laughs> Open and close facilities to meet your changing fortunes. Negotiate shrewd contracts with suppliers to keep costs low and quality high. Manage payroll and determine how to best staff your business. This seems like it's gonna be a lot of work, which is fair because business is hard. Make the right decisions to keep workforce morale high, interview and hire the best job candidate, interact with your employees and sponsor team building activities, know who and when to fire, ready to exit, sell your company to the highest bidder. Oh shit. Got the right resume, get appointed CEO of someone else's company, all new business achievements, a new surprise outside of business and numerous bug fixes. Okay. Business. Okay. So business isn't a special talent. Now, I have no clue if we're gonna need university or if we can just do it out of high school. Like I have no idea what to expect. So I guess this is gonna be more so of a walkthrough and then we'll actually, I'll actually make videos in the future of actually starting like a successful business and becoming a billionaire. I wanna be from the US because capitalism. Why do I kind of want to name myself like Elon Musk? I'm gonna be female because female CEO, boss babe. One, two, three, four, five period. Attributes. I'm going to cheat a bit. I want to give myself a good like start. So we'll do high willpower. Karma's good and we'll do high discipline. I was conceived on the washing machine. Oh my god, my father is Elmer Musk. Close enough. Elon. Graduation. Okay, let's take some time off. I don't know if we need university. I'm nervous. Okay, special careers. I can't believe it's actually here. Start up, acquire, or lead a company. Ooh, I don't have money, so we can't purchase an existing business. Okay, so we have startup. Start up your own business, acquire, so it's purchasing our own business, but we don't have any money, so let's start up. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, I'm nervous. Food truck. What happens when we click on it? No. <laughs> oh, so I need this money to even begin investing. Oh no, I didn't prepare properly. Okay, so, oh no. Food truck, we need 200K to invest. Gift shop, 300K. So there's health food store, which is high demand. A brewery, lingerie boutique. Oh my God, I could become like a stripper in the beginning and then, and then start my own lingerie boutique. Marijuana dispensary, novelty, pet supply. Oh my God, a dairy farm is 20 million. Car manufacturer is 356. So this is probably great if you have past bit lives and you have a bunch of money. Mama. <gasps> I love my mom. Which one of these is the best, best superhero? Let's go with Black Panther. I am just gonna age and make money and also marry someone rich. One million plus. Get married. I love how I said I wasn't going the sugar natty route, but I still am. Propose at a fancy resort. Well, that's mean. If he dies, I swear. <laughs> at a botanical garden. He accepted. Now it's time to take all his money. I was thinking we can start up a business from literally like zero dollars or like a hundred dollars. I didn't think we'd need like so much money, but that's fine. So I am just gonna age until I am 40. So I have a bunch of money. <laughs> Special careers, business. What about a choir? Okay, so acquiring a business, they're all in the millions. So we're not there. What should we go with? The only thing we can afford is food truck, gift shop, 
brewery or health food store. I feel like we should go with a health food store because there's high demand. You don't want low demand because it's probably gonna take so much more money to invest in it, which is what I could do for a future video, doing a low demand one and turning it into like a huge empire. But instead for this video, let's go with health food store. Okay, start up a health food store business today. The demand is high, the competition is like medium. So the minimum investment is 672K and we can put all the way up to how much money we have. Let's go with a flat million because our salary is like 200k. Vita Life Garden. <laughs> natural, natural foods. Should I call it Whole Foods? <laughs> Whole Foods. <laughs> Select name. You started a new health food store business. The company is Whole Foods. <gasps> what will you pay yourself as CEO of Whole Foods? Hello? Salary? Oh my god. 93k? I'm doing all the way at the beginning. Hello? Available capital is 1.6 million. Okay, select salary. Oh gosh, I'm nervous. Oh my god, there's so much. Okay, introduce a new product line today. The market research cost is 3,600. Product launch cost is 9,000. Pick your product. I like the, f oh my god, I love the fact that it does it for me. I was worried I would have to like name everything myself. I was like, honey, I don't, I don't got the energy for that, the patience. Keto bar. <laughs> Detox in a box. Let's do simple protein powder. Perform market research or launch product direct. Directly. That probably is very important because if we perform research, we'll know if it's good. But if we just launch it directly, it might go really bad. So we're gonna be very careful, okay? And we're gonna do perform market research. <sighs> You performed market research on the protein powder product segment. The product was protein powder. Does this mean it was good or bad? Okay, Mick protein powder. What will you name your new protein powder product? Hmm, Mick protein, priceless protein, mama's protein. I like Mick protein. That was good. Introduce product. I'm scared. Okay, let's see. How does it? There is so much detail. I'm actually very pleasantly surprised. Edit your production plan today. Fixed cost per unit. Ah, adjust your fixed cost by changing your supplier. Oh, a new supplier may give you a lower fixed cost. Oh, there's so much pressure. There's so much to know. Oh God. Okay, it says at the bottom, the total cost for this product will be 745,000 and the available capital is only 850. Can I adjust my marketing? Can I not adjust these? Okay, so I can't adjust my fixed cost. I can't adjust my marketing cost. Okay, so if I do this, it'll go into debt. <laughs> so let me do $15 for marketing cost, fixed cost per unit, the price per unit. Let's do $25, $25. I could do 126,000 units. That's so many. <laughs> Let's start with the middle. Let's do 69,000. <laughs> oh no, I can't do, okay, we have negative. Okay, save. Now what do I do? I'm scared. Okay, CEO of Whole Foods. Okay. Ah, there's so much. Ah, there's so much. I'm overwhelmed. That is our health food store. We have Mick protein powder, zero dollars in annual sales. Oh my gosh. Okay. We got to do this one thing at a time. I'm overwhelmed. So we have CEO of Whole Foods, health food store industry products. So I'm not sure if we can have multiple businesses, but so far it's just one. Activities are annual reports, balance sheet. Okay. This is company Whole Foods, facility cost, payroll cost, my salary production cost 1.5 million per year bonus take a bonus <laughs> i can't do that yet i don't have enough money okay so the balance sheet is literally i guess like us taking track of all the things that cost money okay so we have one store open a new store cool employees hey my marketing manager is derek trump Okay, so we have two hippies working for us. We have a buyer and a store manager. So, oh my God, there's so much. If we go to our marketing manager, we can compliment him, we can fire him, give him a bonus, recognize him. What does that mean? Or warn him or yell at him. You can hire a new employee. Take a direct involvement in hiring for your company today. Open position is sales associate. Okay, we're not doing that yet. I'm overwhelmed. Next, we have invest. Make another investment. Make another investment in your business. Okay. That's adding more money to it. Payroll. So we have five employees. The compensation is average. So the annual payroll, it also said that on our balance. There is dirt cheap, low, average, above average, and big bucks. So let's just go with average for now. And we can increase our employees. Yeah, we can. Okay, but for now, let's stick it with five the way it is. I don't want to change them. <laughs> so there's also sell the company, but we don't have any money yet. <laughs> 
And then we have team building, sponsor a team building activity. This is like when we're working for a normal job in BitLife and like it says your boss wants to go boating with you at a lake. So now we get to do that. Okay, not doing that yet though. And valuation, seek a company valuation and we can add a new product. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, okay. Oh my God, this is so cool. Honestly, I, I was like kind of afraid that this wouldn't be like as detailed as it is, but I'm very pleasantly surprised. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, how do we begin? McProtein. Now we see Fargo Wellness Warehouse. It's our warehouse. Protein powder has a high customer rating. It's like average. So now we have to do a production plan. Figure your annual production. That's what we just did earlier. Rebrand the product. Look for a new supplier. Yes, I remember it said that you can adjust your fixed unit cost by choosing a new supplier. So we're not gonna do that yet. I haven't even aged. So I wanna see what happens when we age. I think that's what we have to do to continue in the business and to try and get money. I'm not sure. So let's just see what happens when we age. Oh, okay. It pops up when we age. <gasps> Oh no. Okay, the annual report for your first fiscal year of CEO of Whole Foods is now available. It was a challenging year. Oh no, okay. The revenue was 1.2 million. Net income was negative 535,000, which was a profit margin of negative 42%. And the sales, oh, my performance was low. <laughs> I have gone bankrupt. Business Whole Foods has gone bankrupt and been liquefied by authorities. What will you do? Blame myself or blame everyone else? I am blaming you all. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, so I think instead of all these big numbers, I gotta start a lot smaller. Let's do another startup. Let's do small. Let's go with food truck and invest bare minimum. There's a lot of competition. I'm gonna figure this out. Start my business. The Skeleton Key Food Truck. Yum Yum Palace. I like that. Start a food truck business. Salary, I'm gonna give myself a low salary. I don't need a lot of money. 4,700. Let's do bean and cheese burrito. Hold pork. Funnel cake. Funnel cake is a good one. Perform market research. Okay, high demand. I see now. When I do perform market research, it tells me the demand and competition. Okay, so there's high demand and there is medium competition. So launch the product. Quality funnel cake, funnel cake queen, Mick funnel cake. Fun L cake. <laughs> So I guess unless you have a lot of money in the beginning, like hundreds of millions, you can't afford to mess up using high numbers. We got to start low. Introduce product. Fixed cost per serving, $2 is fine. Price per serving. I don't know what the difference is between fixed cost per serving and price per serving. Fixed price is how much it costs to produce and cost is how much you're charging for. Production, 43,000 43, servings. Let's try. Okay, I'm the CEO of Yum Yum. Should I hire more employees? or less let's just see funnel cake rebrand supplier 242 214 look for another one 246 look for another one 226 nah let's age and see what happens <laughs> I didn't go bankrupt at least. Um, the annual report for your first year as CEO. The revenue was 194K, not bad, but negative 65%. <laughs> Bankruptcy warning. At least I'm not actually bankrupt. In the middle of a busy workday, you notice your employees, Minas, Athen, jamming to Drake instead of getting through his workload. Oh my God, work. Mm, my employees don't like me. Give her a bonus. $500, baby, work harder. Okay, 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 okay. Hold on. This new supplier will give us $2.16 per serving. Okay, which is less, it's cheaper, so that's good for us. And the quality is slightly less, but it's about the same. So let's sign a contract with them. And age, oh, oh my God, we did so much better this time. Revenue was 170K, but our profit margin was only down 30%. I was only down 31%, but the other one was 65. Okay, it suffered a contraction in revenue, but all of our available servings sold out. Analyst forecast, you could, okay, I might have to invest more. So let's keep existing production plan. Oh God, I'm scared. At least I'm figuring this out. You decide to implement a strategy for keeping employees engaged with the core values of the company. You determine it's imperative to select one that is in line with your mission statement. What will you do? Weekly meetings. Okay, so I think I need to reinvest in my company. So make another investment. Let's do 500K baby. Put it all in. Increase my production servings to $124,000. $4? Increase marketing cost a little bit. Save. And look for a new supplier. No, look for another one. These are all more expensive. Oh my god, it's better. Five cents more, but its quality is even better. Let's sign a contract with them. Okay, I think we're figuring it out. I really hope so. Um, let's age and see if that worked. <gasps> 
Oh my God, our revenue was up 228%. The net income went up by 148%. The profit margin was five. I figured it out. Oh my God, I figured it out. I figured it out. Your funnel cake product enjoyed a very strong revenue growth and sold out. Analysts forecast next year's demand to increase by 22% as a result of more consumers preferring to eat on the go rather than at a restaurant. Okay, customer rating was 61%. Edit the production plan, make 130,000 serving. Is that the most we can do? I really hope we can do more. Okay, let's save. Employee Marilyn stuck her tongue out at you? Warn her. I told her that she'll get the ax if she doesn't adjust her attitude. Okay, oh my God, this is so fun. This literally feels like I was not expecting it to have this much detail and I'm loving it. I'm obsessed. Okay. Facility cost, payroll, salary, all that has changed, but I don't really need to read it. So I thought, I thought I hired a new employee. Prep cook, find a candidate. You have identified a candidate for your open prep cook position. Oh, the initial impression was good. Hmm. Let's interview her. Oh my God, we can interview them. What question will you ask the candidate for your open prep cook position? What animal best represents your work ethic? How do you handle conflict? What are your salary expectations? How do you handle conflict? Her answer, I handle conflict. I'm avoiding it. I love the honesty, hire her. <laughs> okay, how do I? I don't think we're ready enough to add another product. Team building, let's do team building. Um, Let's do a drag show. The total cost is 60 bucks, that's fine. Let's do it. Their enjoyment. How did they not enjoy that? Okay, see, look, your one was horrible. <laughs> your two is okay. Year three was getting better. Facilities, open a new truck. Yeah, we're not there yet. $2,000, let's do it, let's see. Ah, <laughs> it's only 545,000. Okay, I'm gonna age. Ah, uh, no! <laughs> oh no, oh no. Net income was negative $1,000. How do I? Oh no. My employee has been reading erotic Lord of the Rings fan fiction at work. Do nothing, enjoy yourself. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Do I funnel cake? Supplier quality is high. The customer rating is high. What's the issue? I don't get it. Okay, we rebranded it. Production plan. Price per serving, maybe let's cheapen it. 390. Oh, I can increase the amount of servings. Should I go up? 165,000? Like, should I be increasing and adding new employees every year? I'm not sure. I'm gonna definitely figure this out more for future videos, but this is just my first initial reaction to this. Should I look for a new supplier? Ooh, 196 per serving. Sign a contract. The quality is basically the same. That's amazing. Okay, invest. I don't think I'm ready. Oh no, oh no, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Negative 1.4 thousand percent. Oh no, what did I do wrong? Oh no, okay. Okay, I think I have to do a different product. Edit production plan. Fixed cost per serving. Let's do 90,000 servings. Let's decrease the marketing cost. Save. I am gonna do another product. I'm gonna see what happens, okay? Bulgogi burger. Okay, launch product. Quality burger. Price's burger, Musk's burger. Oh boy, I'm scared. Fixed cost per serving is $4. Marketing cost, I'll keep the marketing cost the same. I don't wanna change that just in case. Price per serving, we'll do like seven, six, seventy-five. Thirty-two thousand 32,000 servings, save. I'm scared. Ugh, the new quality is horrible. And that's horrible too. Okay, down 20 cents. Let's, let's sign a contract with them. Let's see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Yes, okay. We made a net income of 19K. <laughs> uh, <laughs> profit margin is still 4%. Oh God. We still made 300K though. Okay, keep existing product plan. <gasps> oh my God, the Musk's burger did well. Okay, so maybe it was just a funnel cake problem. We made $217,000. The customer rating is 62%. How do we increase the customer rating? You want to place a custom banner above your office door that states your most important company value, teamwork. Did I take a higher salary so I can actually like, every year, let's do 37,000. Oh, I don't want evaluation. Do more servings. Price per serving, we'll do $7. Marketing, let's do a flat $1. I really wish I could type it in. Ah, okay. Okay, I'm scared. Let's just decrease the price, $3. I'm scared. Save, okay. Funnel cake, let supply, look for a new supplier. Oh, that's horrible quality. That, it, mm, I don't think that's worth going down though for. Yeah, that's not, that's not worth it. We wanna keep good quality. Okay, Musk's burger, look for a new supplier. That's, 
Oh, that is worth it. 70 cents cheaper and even higher quality. Boom. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, I mean, Musk's burger did really well. I don't get what it means when it's net negative. Does that mean funnel cake did really bad? Because this one, we increased by 70%. It is the funnel cake. It is the funnel cake. So I think I have to stop the funnel cake. While reading reviews of your Musk's burger product online, you notice a user with the handle Gilmore Girls Forever has defended the product against the haters, like the user post. Okay, so I think we have to get rid of the priceless funnel cake retire the product it is oh total profit was 2.7 million but it, it is negative every year so let's focus on the burger so let let's not rebrand it production plan increase the price per serving 750 and let's do 98,000 servings let's see if we have a good year this year oh ha ah, not worth it <laughs> i'm scared oh god they all hate me okay whatever we're gonna age see what happens Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, we had a net income increase of 435%. 430%. Oh, okay. 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 The customer rating is going up, which is good. It's 75%. We sold 98,000 servings. The revenue is 740 thousand. Okay, edit production plan. Increase to 141,000. Increase the price per serving maybe. <laughs> save, save, save. Oh god. Marilyn keeps reading fan fiction, but enjoy it. Let's give myself 62,000. Ah, uh, we're gonna age again. Let's try again. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we finally have our performance in the green. You had to write off some inventory? Age? Huh? Or what? <laughs> a million in sales <laughs> production plan okay old do i need to rebrand it fargo burger maybe what happens if i rebrand it oh uh, my father passed away plan his funeral um cremate him okay 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 how it is revenue was 1.1 million i see how you are it's fine though it's fine though we are making money they prank called my office phone from her desk you are fired get sued i'm being sued by an employee my former employee filed a wrongful termination lawsuit against me. She has offered you an opportunity to settle out of court at $31,000. No. Fight the lawsuit. Which local law firm will you hire to defend you against your former employee's wrongful termination? Jenkins and Justice. Ha! <laughs> ah! Oh, wait, I lost. No! I lost the wrongful termination lawsuit brought on by your former employee, Desiree Kent, and have been ordered to pay his damages and legal fees. You prank called me. You deserved it. No. <laughs> no. Make another investment. We are putting $1 million. No, that's too much. Eight, $700,000 into our company. Let's go to Fargo Burger production plan. 176,000 servings. Let's do $13 per serving. Marketing cost two dollars. I'm not sure if it's better to do because like in my head I'm like oh two dollars per serving for marketing means it'll do more marketing So it's better, but then what if you're actually supposed to do less? I don't know. See what happens. <laughs> Let's see what happens <laughs> Oh <laughs> I have got guess that's the end of the video. I will get better at this and I will make more soon. And if any of you have tips, let me know. <laughs>